guys I'm back with another video and today I'm gonna be doing the church night showcase so I'm gonna be the little touch subject and um, you know my boy metal is gonna help me out so um, if you want to become a church night you have to go chaotic and um, a church night has um, four moves it has um, triple strike serpent strike chain pull and I don't really want to call this a move but it's like the m2 version right so it also has its own little M2. So you can take it from here, my G. Okay, so one of the skills they get is called Serpent Strike. What it does is it stabs them and they get poisoned. The next skill is Triple Strike. It stabs three times and is like the Surgeon Knight's Action Surge. So if you have a gem, it could stack multiple times. Um, chain pull is like scorpions get over get here, over where here. it has long range and it can pull them to you, and you can combo right after. Hold on, let me eat, let me eat, let me eat, <laughs> let me eat. Okay. Now, their combat has, um, it's different than normal ones, where they have like, like this. Two different animations, mm -hmm. You also get this M2. And if you want to, like, um, get up to your opponent, you can do a different uh, form of that, where if you press Q, it can be a close-range version. Alright, so we have... Okay. Okay, so, um, do you have any tips or, like, ideas or, like, anything that you want to say to the audience so if they want to go church night they can get it like any tips any ways to make it easier well you need at least 80 grips and spear xp mm -hmm. it costs 400 silver mm -hmm. and um uh get either pit fighter outfit or the church night outfit but what stats do those, um, what, what, what do those armors do for people that want to get church knight? What's the armor do? Yeah, so. Pit fighter increases, like, health, um, and attack speed. Mm -hmm. And, um, the church knight armor increases health, like, health and, like, I think attack. Mm-hmm. Alright, so, so that so so personally i would go for the pit fighter outfit because it gives more attack speed understand all right so now um we're gonna 1v1 real quick i'm not gonna use my phoenix feather it's gonna be hard but um i try not to use it and um let me get my stuff right i'm gonna i'm gonna just use okay guys so um, i'm ready and we about to do this 1v1 all right you ready three round one right. Let's Navy, go. go. Uh -huh. All right. Hello, <laughs> well, yes, but this is really it. Um, <laughs> that's what looks in Ashton. Um, it's kind of unfair because, like, you know, he's a super and I'm an ultra, and I have Tomas and like all this stuff. But yeah, th that's what it looked like in battle. But 
Um, in my opinion, it's a good class because you can use it for close range moves and you can use it for for far far range moves. Um, thank you, Metal, for like helping me out with the showcase. And if you like this video or if you want to see more of this content, please like, comment, and subscribe. Um, you know, um, um, I'm making another Oni again, so I'm gonna be showing more gameplay with Oni. I'm gonna be showing more gameplay with my main also. Um, and also, I wanted to say that I just want to thank him for helping me with the showcase because, like, there's a lot of stuff that people didn't showcase on YouTube, and it would be a hassle for me to, like, make alts and, like, get that ultra class when I can have people just help me, um, provide information to you guys and to explain it to you guys. So, that's how he would be explaining it. Um, I just want to thank him, and, uh, I just want to thank my supporters for, um, supporting me. So, um, smash that like button. Um, hit that notification button and hit that subscribe button and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you.